Santa Cruz Metro Station has been constructed using a combination of the cut and cover method and the new Austrian tunneling method, that is NATM, driven by the presence of a nearby flyover and neighboring slums. This hybrid approach enabled the station to be built partially under the slum and in close proximity to the flyover, ensuring minimal disruption to both structures and communities. The result is an integration of both modern infrastructure and urban realities. Executing such a large project in a city like Mumbai with dense populace was not easy. Let's have a look at the unique challenges faced Santa Cruz Metro Station Limited Space and Utility Proximity. The construction of Santa Cruz Metro Station posed a significant challenge due to its placement between Kalina Vakula flyover and a sizable 2400 mm diameter water main. The available gap between the micropiling and the flyover was just 1.68 meters and only 0.66 meters from the waterline on the eastern side. The team MMRC, to address this challenge, designed and implemented a robust earth retaining structure to ensure stability and prevented displacement near these critical utilities. Innovative underground approach. Another noteworthy challenge was the innovative construction method employed for Santa Cruz Metro Station. This involved creating a portion of the station underground using the NATM. This technique involved expanding a tunnel initially formed by a tunnel boring machine, that is TBM, beneath the Dauri Nagar community. This approach allowed for the establishment of an underground station within the existing tunnel framework. Once Santa Cruz Metro Station is operational, it will enhance connectivity to neighboring areas such as Kalina Santa Cruz Railway Station and Vakola, facilitating improved transportation links.